hello everyone so in this video we are going to see how we can start hunting on open bug bounty platform so this is this video is basically about the roadmap on this platform so let's start so you just have to open this URL that is openbugbounty.org into your browser and after opening this website will look somewhat like this And yeah, so it looks like this. I will just go on to report a vulnerability. You just have to remember guys, to hunt on this platform, you should have a valid Twitter account. And you need to log in using Twitter only. So yeah, I have a Twitter account. So I'm just going to sign in with my Twitter account over here. So I will click on authorize. Yes, so now I'm currently logged in into the application. I will just click on report vulnerability again. And you can see coordinated and responsible vulnerability disclosure. Perfect. I will just quickly click on I agree with the above mentioned ethics guidelines. And in the vulnerability details section, I'm going to choose the vulnerability that I have found out. So let's say XSS. So yeah. You can choose XSS, CSRF, anything. So I'm going to choose XSS and in the XSS URL, you have to give which website and which endpoint you found the XSS. So let's say HTTPS example.com slash parameter equals to XSS. Let's say this is the injection point. In the post data, you can just give the data from burp suit, the post request, which leads to this XSS. Okay, so perfect. Cookies, if it is an authenticated one, you can give your session cookies. And in the application, you just have to choose custom code, that's it. And in comment section, you have to write the steps to reproduce. So you can just type step one, go to this URL, step two, hit enter into your browser and you'll be able to see an XSS alert executes, which confirms that there is a XSS vulnerability. You have to click on all of this, basically check box everything, and you have to click on submit. So after you click on submit, your vulnerability report will be submitted to open bug bounty. So as you can see, thank you, public vulnerability submission will be verified soon. So my report has been submitted. Obviously this is a blank report which I submitted to demonstrate to you guys. And you can see a ID has been assigned that is 1146795 ID to this report, submission date, status pending. And yeah, basically this report is, will be verified and it will go in, if it is a valid vulnerability is going to go into this on, on hold section over here. If it is not a valid report, it is going to go in rejected submissions. These are some blog posts which you can read. People keep writing about vulnerabilities that they find. In the researcher account settings, guys, you can see you can keep your profile settings. You can write your intro, how to contact you, your contact certifications, if any and hall of fames if you have done any and you can just save this profile so a very simple functionality over this open bug brown open bug bounty platform it is very simple and very convenient to report vulnerabilities now one most important thing to remember guys in open bug bounty it is not like programs or anything like we saw on hacker one on bug crowd in open bug bounty this is basically by open source community which means you can try to report any vulnerability that you find onto the internet so any vulnerability into any application of any country you can report that valid bug over here okay so there is a lot of big scope of you reporting valid vulnerabilities on obb platform 
because there are millions and millions of website and you can just test them make them your testing playground but remember do not do any types of intrusive testing or any misuse of the data if you have found a valid vulnerability on any website just try to report it over here after reporting that vulnerability over here open bug bounty researchers team will try to connect with that program or that company and they will try to fix it after fixing those people will get in touch with you and they are going to reward you with some swag or hall of fame or maybe rewards it depends on the company if i go to my dashboard as you can see whatever i have done over here so this is the first thing i'll go into the recommendation if anyone gives you a recommendation it, it comes over here badges if you earn any badge so as you can see the first badge is for 10 plus websites second badge is for 50 plus 500 plus websites if you report valid vulnerabilities last is 1000 plus similarly there are a lot of badges which you can unlock i have unlocked one blog author batch which i which i wrote a year ago okay so you can earn your badges statistics you can see whenever you are hunting blog you can write and you can read blogs perfect so i hope you guys understood this let's go in the hall of fame top security researcher and see the top rec security researchers list you can see as this researcher which is calvin has helped in patching 17416 programs so he has submitted those many reports let's go to the profile and you can see the researcher reputation is this much fixed these many websites in the certificate you can see open bug bounty has given an outstanding researcher certificate to this user because the user has submitted a lot of reports and help to fix a lot of vulnerabilities you guys can also get the certificate by reporting valid vulnerabilities for around 50 to 100 and you will get also get a certification perfect you can see what are the reported vulnerabilities by this user also so yeah this is it i hope you guys understood how we can create an account on this website and we can start our bug bounty hunting journey onto this platform. I hope this helps. Thank you guys. Thank you so much.